Hello everyone, this video is about usually out effect hook. What is usually out effect hook? Uh, usually out effect hook works exactly as the same use effect hook. We have already explained the use effect hook in another video. You have the link for that video in the description. Uh, but the difference is that when it runs. Okay, the difference is when it runs. Um, use effect hook runs after the DOM is printed on the browser. Okay, when you were all elements printed, then the use effect hook will run. And but the use layout effect hook runs before the DOM is printed on the browser. It is the difference between these two. Uh, for example, whenever we want to run uh, some code, a piece of code before the DOM is printed, okay, like uh, height, width, anything related to the layout, okay. So for that purpose, we use use layout effect hook. So that is the reason that the name of this hook is uh, use layout hook. And uh, the second difference is that uh, the use layout effect hook is synchronous but the use effect is asynchronous. Synchronous means that, uh, for example, there are three statements. It will learn the first one. When that complete, it will move to the second, then to the third. And the most common use cases for the use layout effect is used to uh, get the dimensions of the layout. So it was the um, use case of it. So now we will explain it through uh, an example. Uh, for example, we have a toggle example. Let's see it. Okay, this is a toggle example for whenever we press it will display, it will uh, remove back. So, this is the example that we will explain now the use layout effect hook. So, now let's add use layout hook and use effect hook. Use layout effect hook and let's console.log. We will show that in the console use layout effect hook and it will update render whenever we update toggle variable in the same code we will write for use effect hook let's copy this and just paste it here just change the use layout effect to use effect hook so after changing that so now let's check the example yeah let's refresh it again so right now we have use layout effect hook. Uh, let's change the text. Use effect hook. See, first it will render the use effect uh, layout effect hook, then use effect hook. Let's press this button. See again, first render it, then it okay. <coughs> now let's change the change the order also. For example, let's write it at the top. Again, it will render. Uh, first of all, let's press the toggle. See, first of all, this one, and then the use effect. Again, first use effect hook, then use uh, use layout effect hook. First of all, then use effect. Again, let's press this again. Okay, so it means that uh, the use layout effect hook will render first, then it will render the DOM, uh, these elements, then it will uh, come to the use effect hook. The flow is that first of all, it will um, yeah, whenever it come to the components. ReactJS first it will render the these DOM uh, first it will run use layout effect hook then the DOM elements then it will run use effect hook so it is the flow of this uh, mm, uh, ReactJS so uh, I hope that you got an understand about the use layout effect hook and this is used to just for the dimensions up uh, and for the layout I hope this video was helpful for you if you like this video don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel thanks for watching.